All right, YouTube, time for a quick walk and talk, but I just wanted to say how much I love white people. You know, white people, they look good, they talk nice, they're nice people, they've done so much for us in terms of uh, innovations in technology and medicine, and um, I don't know, I just, I just wanted to say how much I love white people. <laughs> um, but on a more serious note, I actually want to go ahead and tell, tell you guys a quick story here. When I was... Um, I think this was in between fifth and sixth grade. I was going to the summer program called Camp Cruise, and it was um, it was a very shitty program. I mean, this was where single mothers dropped their kids off, you know, so they could go to work and you know, bless their hearts. But the the camp supervisors, you know, were mostly women. Had a couple of guys there. I'm sure they were a little light loafers, <laughs> but um, they were. Um, they basically were just trying to emasculate us and like I just wasn't having any of it and I ended up getting kicked out because um, I was wrestling this kid and he got hurt and it was just I don't know it was, it was pretty bad just trying to block the wind there there we go um but uh something happened though we went to um we went to uh, Harbor High, and you know, because they were uh, they had the pools open during the summer, you know, just for a swim day or whatever. And there was this group of girls there. One of them, who, whom I really was pretty attracted to at the time, her name was Vanity. She was a, a blonde white girl, and she had a couple other friends. It was like a Hispanic girl and a black girl and a couple other white girls, but. One of them uh, came up to me. I think it wasn't Vanity. It was one of the other white girls. And, you know, she's telling me, like, oh, like, that girl, she really likes you. Like, uh, like oh, okay. Well, which one? She's like, oh, the, the, you know, I don't remember what her name was, but the, but the black one. I said, oh. And this is what I said. I said, I would never go out with a black girl. And what happened was... This, I guess she got triggered. The white girl did. She went and told one of the camp supervisors. And the camp supervisor ended up calling my mom. <laughs> and my mom was, you know, she said, is that true? Did you say that? I said, yeah, it's true. <laughs> I did say that. Anyways, they're just trying to misconstrue it. Like I was like a little racist. Like they're concerned about my mom's teachings like a, it's like fuck them honestly you know another another goddamn business but it was something that I never really I honestly uh, I never felt really comfortable with and then more recently when I started you know getting more into race and realism and stuff like this I almost felt kind of redeemed because it's actually part of our genetic makeup to go after mates that look the same. This is why you see so many... Excuse me. This is why you see, many, see so many white people with white people and black people with black people. On average. I know there's anomalies of interracial couples and you know YouTube and the entertainment industry that try and prop them up and basically make it look like it's normal which it isn't I've never dated any girl that was a different race from me I've dated two girls in my life I dated a, uh, a white girl and a white girl with a little bit of Italian in her that's it Italian and Argentinian so I, I, I guess I felt redeemed I felt redeemed when I started to hear about all this stuff, like tribalism and all this stuff, because it shouldn't be that way. It should not have to be that way where young men feel guilty about wanting to date. I was younger, I was like, you know, fifth grade. But still, young men should not feel pressured into dating women that they are not comfortable with. And that's exactly what was happening here at Camp Cruise. They said, Basically saying like, you know, this is very 
racist behavior coming from your son, your your fifth grader son. <laughs> so, I don't know. I just I thought I'd go ahead and share that with you guys. I love white people. Thank you so much for watching. God bless, and I'll see you later.